I'm Samantha Vallejo. And I'm Eric Granados, and today we've got a jam-packed show for you. But first, it's time for the Hot Topic Rundowns. Short and sweet and just enough to keep you in your seat. November 6 is almost here, and you know what that means. Election Day. Voters will elect the future President of the United States, Republican candidate Mitt Romney or Democrat candidate Barack Obama. The choice is yours. Texas Southern University has been facing a lot of heat in the media from hazing allegations within the band and NCAA sanctions for sports teams. We'll have more on that later on in the show. Last week, Houston's Mayor Anise Parker revealed the 2012 Hispanic Heritage Award recipients. Congratulations to all the recipients. The U.S. celebrates National Hispanic Heritage Month from September 15th to October 15th. Join us in the celebration as we bring you the first of many episodes of Conexión Latina. The presidential election is right around the corner and immigration remains a top issue for many Latino voters. Time magazine says that Latinos will pick the next president. They count for the largest and fastest growing minority in the U.S. and in 2008, 50% of Latino citizens went to the polls. This time around, lack of voter registration and motivation make for compelling agendas for both presidential nominees. In an interview with Executive Director Fio Houston, Cesar Espinosa says this election is about the DREAMers. People need to realize that the DREAM Act is something that the United States needs. Uh, we invest 12 years of education, 12 years of taxpayer money, uh, which also immigrants contribute to that. Uh, but they, we invest 12 years as a society into children and then to have them graduate and to have them graduate from college and then tell them, well, you have to go back home. It's, it's in a way throwing away our money, throwing away the investment that we have made. Jessica Castillo, a biology major at TSU, says tuition is a top issue for young Latinos when casting their vote. Education that is affordable and that is good. Not only a basic education, but an education that would get us somewhere in life. Reporting from Texas Southern University, I am Eric Granados with Conexión Latina TSU TV. Regardless of what side of the immigration issues you're on, it's your duty to vote. Let your voice be heard. Lights, camera, action. Director Valdemar Rodriguez rolls out the red carpet for the premiere of his controversial film, In Search of the American Dream. Illegal immigration is one of the central issues in Valdemar's film, In Search of the American Dream. The story centers on a family fighting to stay together in light of their parents' recent arrest and their imminent deportation. Valdemar Rodriguez is not only the director of the film, but also the writer and lead actor. After 15 years of hard work, his dream is finally a reality. In celebration of Hispanic Heritage Month, Valdemar held a Hollywood-sized premiere here in the heart of Texas. Estamos bien emocionados de tener esta película aquí en nuestra ciudad y les agradecemos a toda la ciudad de Houston por brindarnos este este bonito presentación. The red carpet was filled with Latino superstars from Rico and Rainy Rodriguez, Irma Infante, and even Ramona Ayala, all supporting Valdemar's vision. Pues un saludo para todos nuestros amigos, verdad, que les gusta el cine. Hoy va a ser la primera de esta gran película. Los invitamos para que posteriormente vayan a verla. Está muy buena. The actors who got a chance to work alongside Valdemar also lit up the scene. Jeremy Becerra had an opportunity to share his experience with us. It was like a big history class, so I got to like basically just learn more than I would learn in actually school and stuff and uh, the Mexican side of everything. Some local celebrities, who also happened to have a small role in the movie, were there. Sheriff Adrian Garcia, Commissioner Sylvia Garcia, and journalist Minerva Perez. Even the city of Houston had a special surprise up their sleeve. So therefore, on behalf of Anise D. Parker, mayor of the city of Houston, we hereby proclaim September 26, 2012 as In Search of the American Dream Day in the city of Houston. Congratulations, sir. <laughs> 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 
you know what they say, everything is bigger in Texas, and this film premiere is no exception. Stephanie Madrid for Conexión Latina. If you'd like to see more behind the scenes footage, visit us online at ConexiónLatinaOnDemand.com. Want to know how to get fit while dancing? Haven't decided what movie to watch this weekend? Well, we'll give you the scoop when we return. <laughs>